Hi there. Um, I was going to try and record this on a mobile phone, but it's it's not worked. So anyway, I'm going to do it now, hopefully, because um, I don't know if you're actually interested in chemtrails and all the rest of it. Now, I personally am not convinced that all chemtrails are sprayed by nuts and bolts planes with actual chemicals. Um, I just think that there's just too many of them. There'd be planes and planes and planes. Somebody would see the hangars. Somebody would see the mounds and mounds of chemicals. And if you looked into this at all, you realise that some of these planes are actually fake. Sounds absolutely crazy, I know, but it's true. But this morning I had a thought. Um, I was thinking, what on earth is this? Why would they be doing that? And I thought, yes. If you believe in, let's say, entities that are amongst us that... Um, keep a physical form even though they're not entirely physical well I have heard it said that as the consciousness of the planet rises it's harder and harder for them to maintain themselves in the physical form that they need to maintain themselves in could it not be the case that what is happening is is these entities are finding it harder to stay if you like cloaked for want of a better word so they have to go and manifest and maybe they think it's easier to manifest themselves as birds and planes way up high in the atmosphere where nobody can see them strange thought I know it's just something that occurred to me the other thing I'd just like to say is, is whatever they are whether they're real or fake or whatever let's try not to let them get us sucked into duality and depression here if you kind of think to yourself, oh God, they're spraying me, they're spraying me, you know, maybe they are, but don't let it get you down. I know people aren't going to like that, but what I'm saying is, is you've got to change it from a different perspective. Look at things from a different perspective. This is, that's the subject of another video, because um, I don't want to make this too long and waffly. But the other thing I would just say is, is that I had a dream about, mm, probably about six weeks ago now, that I got invited to a group of let's say in inverted commas important people a few royals and a few politicians top politicians and David Cameron was there and I remember saying to him now, what is going on with the chemtrails and he said to me yeah, yeah what is going on with the chemtrails do you know what's going on he didn't know I don't think my higher self would would send me a dream like that um, this was before I started actually filming quite a, a bit more of them and thinking about it a bit more that was my higher self telling me this is not a, polit a politician's thing I don't think it is also, they can communicate with you, but I'm not going to go into that now on this video. This is just to say that I think, is it the case that maybe they're having to manifest up there because they can't keep it together down here and hoping no one will notice? It's a thought. Anyway, all right, thanks then. Bye.